<laughs> Hi, good day, good evening, depending on what time you're watching this, welcome to the Motivational Drive. Always make sure to bring you great powerhouses, great community leaders, businessmen and women that make a great impact within their field. With me today, I'm with Mama Mongwe. <laughs> Majiri Mongwe. Majiri Mongwe, thank you so much for your time. Uh, uh, my, Mama Majiri, as you can see, we are at Splash Polokwane. This is a fun place. Can you please just take a video of of just this place. This is our leisure area. Okay. Yes. People that love water wow. come this way wow. and wow. enjoy themselves. Wow. wow. Okay. Now, 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 the, the 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 owner of the place is a very private person. He decided not to come out in the video, not to do, be the one doing the interview. However, he gave us a more than fit uh, individual to come through to the interview who is the head of marketing for this venue who is also the business strategist for this venue mama mungwe uh, how are you, you. mom i'm very well thank welcome you. to the motivational drive thank you so much Leto. wow how many years have you been at this this place it's a year and a half wow. that i've been here wow yes okay can you just uh, tell our people who is mama Mung? what do you do exactly and obviously what have you learned from uh, the owner of the place as uh, working with him. Majiru Mongwe is a professional developer. Okay. She is a lady that's interested in enterprise development. Wow. By qualifications, I am a nutritionist. Oh, wow. And I love working with projects and communities. Okay. Yes. Can we just. Uh, I just want us to catch you. You love working with communities. Oh, wow. Yes. I love community development. I've been a lecturer for 12 years in community development. And now this when this project was started, I saw an opportunity in it mm. to say this can bring a lot of social cohesion. Wow. And it can bring even economic benefits. Wow. Swimming has health benefits. Yes economic benefits and social benefits to our communities and if we start with school children making them know the skill at a young age this place can bring tremendous benefits or important things to live swimming is a scarce skill and making the people learn or be trained as swimmers would save a lot of lives that's true you know, I went to a primary school where we had swimming, mm -hmm. but uh, coming up as a boy, I was never into academic things and all that, so I neglected it. And I regret now lately, because if you can check, the world is actually, third of this world is covered in water. Definitely. If you can swim in this world, you won't survive, <laughs> you won't survive. <laughs> especially if you live at places like Cape Town, you need to be able to learn how to swim. Yes. <laughs> so when did this place uh, open up? Do you mind showing us around the, the venue? I will do so. The place was opened last year in September. So what exactly does this place do? Because we mentioned already it's fun, fun Polokwane, splash Polokwane, but people watching this don't know what exactly do we do here at uh, fun Polokwane. What exactly do we do? What's this place all about? As I've said, we have the leisure place that okay. side where people just come to have fun oh, wow. and they make friendship yes. within this very area. Yes. And we have an academic pool oh, wow. where, where people, people learn, oh, wow. have swimming lessons wow. and learn how to swim. Yes. Wow. And, and, and this venue? This is the braai area okay. where people come and have braais and enjoy meat mm. and drinks <laughs> within this Place. Wow. Yes. Actually, you know what? I think we must do an event here. Watching this, leave a comment below if you want an event to be hosted here. We want us to bring you King Munada right at this place. That's a beautiful stage where people can actually come and, and enjoy and also learn. Bring speakers where people can be educated as you play music. Different, different issues, you know? Laughter and fun have health benefits. Yes. Yes. Oh, the wow. more you love, the, the more you bring out. So if you come here and have fun at fun waters, you will definitely leave the stresses of this world outside this place and come and enjoy or be happy, a happier person in this particular area. 
<laughs> now another question I have for you, Mama. Working with Abut uh, Kala, uh, who's a very proud person. It's not everyone that wants to be on public. It's not everyone that's like a kind of motivational speaker, uh, coming out on TVs and doing radios. And some people just prefer to make an impact from underground. Mm -hmm. So coming uh, working with him, what lessons uh, would you convey to someone that's watching this business lessons that they can uh, learn both from you and from Abut Kala, which uh, lessons would you give to people that are watching this thing? What you know? What I'm interested in business. I want to be like you and I grow up. I want to be like the Aud Pala on such a place, being hospitality. Any business lessons that you have to say to the youth? Humility. Mm. If you look at the owner of this place, how humble he is and how loving he is to oh. all the people, you will realize that he can guide mm. and advise mm. positively. Mm. They do it for this. I've heard one time to the Bismarck say humility is power under control. Definitely. Pride is power out of control. Definitely. You know, can we just uh, see around the place? So you also cater for small kids yes. who come here and play. Wow, I it's love this It's an entertainment place. area mm. and kids play. You know, mm. if you explore, mm. you become adventurous. Wow. So our kids come and explore mm. and play. You know what, and enjoy mom? themselves. Most kids, when they go for school holidays, they opt to go very far, mm -hmm. uh, only to find that there's very actually beautiful places around here. Can we see the bright area other side? There's actually beautiful places that people can come, take school trips, and come here in Limpopo instead of paying a lot of money for kids to go very far. Yes. And I saw Abuti just showed me a very beautiful uh, 22-seater craft shop that you actually bought as for the company to take kids and bring them from their schools to bring them here. Do you want to share more about People's that? People that come to our training lessons yes. for swimming yes. will be comfortable to know that uh, they will be collected mm. from the areas that they attend school at wow. to come to this facility so wow. that our lessons start on time. Punctuality is one of the factors that we have to keep. Oh, wow. Yes. Wow. So currently the draft is not part in the in the premises somewhere else. Yes, for safety oh, wow. reasons. It's yes, that yes because it, it, it's very much a beautiful place. I think even myself, I'll speak with my family. We can come here yes. and just do something. Enjoy yourselves. Yes. yes. I'm very much inspired because the first time that I learned about this place, I saw uh, a friend of mine uh, in the University of Limpopo, Esther. She was coming here on, on her birthday. And then I, to myself, I googled the place because I'm I someone that's more also into events. Uh, yes. I, I did a lot with uh, kids, motivation, so I wanted to, to organize something. So I checked out the place, it was so nice, you know. I even thought the people that manage this place are somewhere overseas, only to find that I met, I actually met local people. Yes. Local people, and it's very much inspiring. Yes. So can we see the, the bright area? Is there, is there something inside? It's full of surprises. Oh, wow. This is a a, a, a room where yes. you can have your team building activities. Wow, that's that's no, that's where yes. I, I made team it. building activities <laughs> and just make the people become relaxed and comfortable. Yes, yes. out of their Which homes. Which do we use there or this one? Coming to okay, okay. Yes. coming to fun waters. Yes, to have your team building activities away from your workplace, mm. away from your home, and you meet other people yes. that are in this area. So by so doing, you can learn more from others when you are here. Meeting friends, meeting colleagues, meeting relatives and everybody. So each one is welcome. Mm. It welcomes all age groups. Mommy, what does it take to come from zero to hero, to come from a destitute background, to be uh, uh, a black child uh, owning such a place so much beautiful what does it take it takes self-discipline oh, wow. and passion mm. focus if you want to become somebody or to make a footprint focus mm. have focus mm. and be self-disciplined mm. by so doing you will achieve more. Wow. Wow. did you hear that focus be determined, self-discipline, self yes, and, which, passion. and passion, and yes. which is what most people lack. They lack the discipline. Uh -huh. They lack the discipline. They want to achieve all the success that you've got today. But in terms of 
consistency and being disciplined, they like that attribute. Definitely. So this is a place where people can relax. Yes. I see that a projector screen, yes. where when you're educating the people, you can use the yes. screen. Wow, no, I like that, yeah. that, that very much. So working with uh, school children, what have you realized is their, um, like their weakness in terms of developing themselves or preparing themselves for tomorrow? Exposure. A lot of people are not exposed to many things. Mm. And by so doing, they, 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 they think those very things are not for them. Mm. They are for some other people. Mm. Whereas they can reach those very opportunities wow. if only they are exposed to those things. Wow. Yeah. Now, the reason, Mami, why we established this channel, we realize that it's not everyone that has access to successful people. Mm. You know? So we established this channel. One can tune in for free of charge. Our content is free. Mm. All you have to do is access Wi-Fi is everywhere. Yeah. Access this. Learn from people like yourself. Learn from people like Abu Pala. Mm. You know, it's for free. Mm. Be exposed mm. because our youth actually think that uh, YOLO. You only live once, and they use that that line to destroy their youth, mm. and they don't think about tomorrow. Mm. So it's very much important to the people that are watching this to understand that for you to be successful, you need to start from an early age. So what inspired you to be in, in nutri, uh, nutrition? Nutrition, man. It's, I will say, nutrition and encompasses all spheres of life. Mm. So you need your food oh, wow. to be able to develop intellectually. You need your food to be able to develop physically. Mm. So there are a lot of milestones that you can reach mm. if you eat well. Mm. Eating a balanced diet. Mm. or living a normal life by eating good food mm. makes you a better person. Wow. You know, actually, uh, before coming here, I just uploaded, I did an interview with Traveller FM last week, uh, I think it was Thursday. They were actually asked, speaking about food and they asked me, what did you eat? Mm. I actually just uploaded the interview. I just want to add on to food. Also food for thought, because yes. Matthew 4 verse 4, says, man shall not live by bread alone, but Definitely. by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of, word, of God. Yes. That's also why we do uh, things like this, so that people can also feed their mind, you know, mm -hmm. and also uh, become well balanced. Mm -hmm. So I, I really like that, mommy. Mm -hmm. can, can we just go and touch the waters and wrap up so that I don't keep, uh, keep the interview long, because obviously we have other engagements to Thank do. Thank you so much. Oh, wow. Yes, you're welcome. No, but this is a very beautiful place. I, yes. I love this place. We're going to be doing a lot of activities together, me and you. Yes. I'm so excited about it. Looking forward to everything. So, so far, how has uh, people been responding to to fun, fun watches? Very well. Okay. Our people have realized that you teach your children before whatever behavior that they have set. So it's very easy to change a child's behavior than to change an adult's behavior. So we are very positive that whatever we are doing is yes. going to bring better results for the people. Wow. As a province. Yes. No, I just wanna yeah, I just wanna wrap up. Uh, but I want to touch the, the swimming pool waters first. <laughs> yeah, just yeah. feel the, 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 the breath of the water, you yes. know. <laughs> then, then we'll wrap it up. Any last words that you want to say to someone that's watching this? Saying, look, you know what, I want to be a successful one day. I will say opportunities are many. Wow. Even if you do not realize them. Some of them are very easy to see that I can do this. Yes. But others are hidden. Hmm. One intelligent man said, if you have never been to a place, you will never be able to talk about that place. Wow. Or you you won't know the stories or the life that's in that particular place. Wow. But once you visit that place, hmm. you will see many things wow. that you can indirectly benefit from it. Hmm. So come to Fano. Come to fun waters to enhance your social life. Wow. Come to fun waters wow. to improve the economy of your country. Now, lastly, a lot of youth, they're looking at stuff like this. Uh, it's a nice car. Like they're that looking at that yes. and say, look, I want to be successful in life in order to drive that. Mm. But, you know, I usually say that's, it's, life is not about what you drive, but what yes. drives you. Do, you. do you have any words that you can say to the youth that, you know what, 
this is just a byproduct of adding value to society. <laughs> I would say to the youth, be valuable. Yes. Be successful. Mm. By so doing, you'll be needed in life. Yes. A valuable person is needed everywhere. Wow. A valuable person is significant. Wow. So, for you to be an indispensable resource, Let me just touch touch this water. Ah. Wow, very nice, very nice. <laughs> if I only had my swimwear, I'd be swimming. Now, lastly, I just want to say, you've heard Mama Mongwe. One thing that I can learn from her is that don't chase possessions, but mm -hmm. seek to be or live a purposeful life. Definitely. Mommy, thank you so much. <laughs> thank you so There's much so for There's so much time. in life. <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> I just asked mommy that we start the video again because we, we missed the other side and I think I'd love it to, to come through on the, the video as well, the academic area. Yes. I thought it should you teach people from that point. No, those are leisure pools. Wow. This is where people that come and have fun wow. come to this area this and they enjoy themselves that side. Wow. But this area is the academic area. Wow. This is where swimming lessons take place. Wow. It's a big, long, can you please take them? Yes, it's a huge pool. That's where you see our Charles Chadwick Gloss coming back. Oh, wow. Yes, wow. this is where we are swimming to oh, wow. 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 This is very great. <laughs> Actually, our cameraman did almost fell in the pool. Definitely. I hope he's a he swimmer. Swim. Oh, yes, wow. he's a swimmer. No, there's, there's no so, way he can be. Uh, at this you want to be yes. He <laughs> can swim. Uh, if I fall in this place, it's going to be another issue. You'll have a rescue. <laughs> Fortunately, Our I just rescue want to, team will be here. <laughs> to see also the other place because you, you never cease to amaze because I, I said let's end the video. Yeah. Only to find that there's another there's place. An academic pool. <laughs> so now yeah. I want us to check that side to make sure that I'm not losing anything this time. Definitely. <laughs> this scarce resource the skill okay. of uh, swimming, it's practiced. Wow. This practice makes perfect. So the people that come here will definitely earn wow. something out of this. Oh, wow. Yes. Wow. Wow. And those are your change rooms. These are the change rooms. <laughs> wow. Yes. Actually, this was a you bonus. You come with your actual clothes or the normal clothes, you get into your swimming gear and swim. Wow. Now, this was a bonus video, actually. Yeah. A bonus two minutes, a bonus three minutes. <laughs> now, this, this time, wonderful. I promise you, we are, we've ended right now. This is wonderful. Do subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment below. What have you learned from Mama Mongwe? What are you inspired? Leave a comment below. Leave the kind of questions that on my next interview, once I go out of my way to find successful people, you want the question you want me to ask. Until now, see you on the next interview. <laughs>